So first of all, EIW, assisting Washington State small businesses to increase capacity resulting in increased profit and job creation. Anyone have any questions with that tagline? Is it appropriate? Well, it got you here, so hopefully it was, it was uh, appropriate. Uh, hit the down button. Uh, we're going to have our meetings here the first Wednesday of each month. Uh, 6.30 is typically a little late for us. We typically like to do 5.30. However, ABC had a board meeting today, so that's why the meeting was held at 6.30. We would like to survey you to get your preferences. I, obviously, I'm not trying to create another organization that just has meetings. I want to create some, uh, some performance measures um, to create some expectations and some deliverables for, for you uh, from us. So, Number one, I wanted to do that. I want to just recap what the agenda was. We've already about the third of the way through it. We've uh, had our introductions. We're working on our organizational presentation. And throughout this presentation, you'll kind of see uh, some of those priorities that we've established. We also want to survey our participants, the priorities and announcements um, that we may have in closing. Um, there is a sign-in sheet. Those of you who have not signed the sign-in sheet, I need to make sure that it makes its way to you. So if you haven't signed in the sign-in sheet, please make sure it gets to you. Also in front of you, you're going to see two documents. One document is actually a membership application. This is the first organization that you're going to join, and I'm not going to ask you for a dime. Um, my preference is, is if you have a dime, go ahead and give us a time. <laughs> um, but for our small business members, we really want to just create this opportunity for the next four months. We want to provide some resources, identify where your biggest priorities are, and make sure that we are incorporating those priorities to, with ours. Um, so as I go through the PowerPoint, you're going to see that. But there's a document. It may be hard for you to read if it's difficult for you to read. Fill out what you can, and then uh, uh, later in the presentation, I'll pull up the document. I'll blow it up so you can actually see what those fields are. And I can even have the document emailed to you. Go ahead, next slide. EIW, what are we? EIW is the Entrepreneurial Institute of Washington. It's going to be a 501c3. That status is pending. I have an appointment with the state this week to submit our final documentation. Uh, we're a nonprofit organization founded to provide small businesses with professional and leadership business support services and technical assistance. Go ahead, next slide. Our mission is to develop a resilient base of job creating entrepreneurs in Washington State by providing small businesses advisory, professional, and technical assistance designed to streamline organizational systems increase the technological capabilities and leadership skills of the owners and their workforce. Obviously, our relationships with organizations like ABC, AGC, AWB, and others are going to be able to provide us with an opportunity to really expand on those uh, organizational services. Another board member who, unfortunately, is not here today, um, his name is Tim Strage. Many of you know him from Tacoma. He's actually the treasurer of EIW and the executive director of the uh, William Factory in uh, Tacoma, Washington. And he's been able to provide some great resources. And they do have video conferencing that we're going to tap into our organization and provide that as an opportunity for some of our professional development courses that we're going to be providing and partnering with. Our vision is to build and sustain a nationally recognized small business capacity program that provides small business <coughs> members with state-of-the-art business solutions and training resources. The back office support, right now we're virtual. However, we're hoping that we'll be able to secure some brick and mortar space. Uh, right now, I'm very active with di different organizations who have brick and mortar space. Uh, some have more than others. So we'll have to find ways to leverage that brick and mortar space and see if it makes sense for some of you that are doing work on both sides. Maybe it makes sense to expand those relationships so you actually have a place to hold those meetings, um, as well as those video conferencing uh, capabilities. 